It's an honor few have undertaken. A tradition going back 60 years for the Air Force Academy, but for those first timers, this year will be special. This is an amazing honor that we've gotten the chance to be a part of. I mean, this happens only once every four years, and you know, we keep on talking about how this is like the cornerstone of our democracy. So just to be able to go down to Washington, D.C. and be a part of that moment, it's a huge honor for all of us going. Hey, hey. The cadets usually perform eyes right, but for the parade, they'll be eyes left in order to salute newly sworn in President Donald Trump as they walk past the White House. The typical command that we do uh, in basic military training and here at the Air Force Academy is an eyes right, but it's it's all it is is just in reverse. And while the steps may be easy, they carry with them decades of tradition of Air Force Academy cadets who have participated in presidential inaugurations. Cadets have been marching in every presidential inauguration since Dwight D. Eisenhower. And as special as that honor is, for some cadets, it takes on a very personal meaning. My dad was an officer in the Air Force for, I want to say, 23 years. My mom was in the Air Force, too. Air Force is what I've been doing my whole life. While the march may only last one day, the memories of friends and family who have worn these colors will live on forever. I would say when we do the eyes left right past the new commander in chief, that's going to be an incredible moment. Definitely one I did not see myself doing when I first came here.